Tensions between the U.S. and China seem to have eased in some areas since President Trump took office. But Washington's latest move could nudge things in the other direction. It's declared China among the world's worst offenders when it comes to human trafficking. Kim Yun Bin has this report. The United States has listed China as among the worst human trafficking offenders in the world. The State Department released its annual trafficking in persons report on Tuesday. Which lumped China in Tier 3, along with 22 other nations that, according to Washington, do not comply with minimum U.S. standards and make no effort to do so. Other Tier 3 nations include Russia, Iran, and Syria. China was downgraded to Tier 3 status in this year's report, in part because it has not taken serious steps to end its own complicity in trafficking, including forced laborers from North Korea that are located in China. The report explained that Beijing sends North Koreans home without screening them for signs of human trafficking, although they could face torture or execution upon their return. Senior State Department official for human trafficking issues, Susan Coppage, says the report is factually accurate. Well, we hope to continue working with, with all governments um, that, are, that are ranked in the report, and sometimes there is initial displeasure with that ranking. However, the report is seen worldwide as a real factual and accurate um, analysis of what's going on in countries such as China. Watchers say the decision may strain relations between Washington and Beijing, especially following President Trump's repeated criticism of China for not doing enough to solve the North Korean nuclear issue. Trump is also reportedly becoming increasingly frustrated with China and is considering possible trade measures, including tariffs on steel imports, according to Reuters. The report also named North Korea as one of the worst offenders of human trafficking for the 15th consecutive year for not exerting any effort to prevent such human rights abuses. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.